Hello guys, it's a short uh, helping tutorial how to install MicroWarrior VR mod to our favorite game. Uh, first, what we need, uh, open Nexus Mods and this link. You can find it in the de description to the video. Uh, on the description page you can find the quick start guide. It's the best guide to, how to understand how to install all the things. Uh, to play the, with this mod. Uh, my video is only a short, uh, I don't know, helpful thing, uh, additional thing to this quick start guide. Okay, next one. Uh, what we should do? Uh, open files, download UEVR config file, using my manual download, or something like this. After this, uh, click to the manual download to main mod, MacWarrior VR, and uh, we uh, can see additional uh, files required like uh, MW5 mod compatibility pack and UEVR. Open it and uh, click download. I downloaded it previously and download MW5 mod compatibility pack files and last version manual download. Open uh, Predog UEVR found this file, find uevr.zip and download to your PC. But uh, previously previously you should uh, whitelist uh, this file or folder when you plan to download this file uh, because antivirus uh, don't like this file and think it is a virus, like uh, some kind of form or something like this. Uh, why? this thing happens uh, because UEVR work like uh, injector uh, it injected the process uh, it injected to the gaming process that's why it, seem, it seems like it's a virus but this file place it on github and uh, guys who understand in programming can check uh, open code of this file and uh, as I know Nothing bad in these files. You can no, you can you can't find anything problem. I don't know. It's like this. And uh, after whitelisting, you can download this file too. And additional uh, toolkit. What I recommended. It's uh, OpenXR toolkit. You open this link and download the latest. After downloading these files. You can, uh, I don't know, see next picture. Like uh, we have MacWarrior VR file, it's a main mod. Uh, we have MW5 mod compatibility pack, uh, OpenXR toolkit, uh, UEVR config file, and additionally UEVR, as example, as, uh, as is. And uh, next one. Uh, we should uh, rename this file to this name UEVR config file to MicWarrior uh, Win64 shipping. Uh, it's important. And next one we can install OpenXR Toolkit. Open, uh, after installing, you should open it with admin rights. It uh, looks like this. Uh, next one, what you should do is unpack UEVR to folder and open UEVR injector with administrator rights. After changing this, uh, click import config, find our file win64 shipping. Open. Close directory. And we ready with UEVR to play with more with VR, but uh, not right now. Next uh, step: unpack our uh, mod folders. Oh, like unpack. Uh, you can open it, right-click, copy, and paste. And repeat to this file. Copy and here you should paste it. After you do these steps, you can open your game folder 
in my case is uh, system C Epic uh, MW5 Mercs, MW4 Mercs, and uh, folder mods. Uh, you should copy your uh, folders from this one to this one. Uh, it's like these folders and this one. You should copy to this folder, mods folder and game folder. Okay, next step what we should do, we should open the game. After opening the game, click to the mods and check all uh, mods what you have in this folder. Like Macquarie VR Cockpits, Macquarie VR Overrides, Macquarie VR Visa Removal, uh, Macquarie VR. At the moment I try to find it. This one and MW file compatibility pack. This one and click apply. After this, you should quit the game. Uh, right now, we are ready to play with VR. Uh, what next? Uh, we start our game. testing we can use this one single player instant action and change biome as example for a sampler is from standard biomes i use uh, many additional for mods if you're interested in, I can record some additional video with my mods and thoughts about these mods. Like change time noon and conditions light, better view. And change kind of mission. As example, in my case it's duel, or something like this maybe. I don't know. Let's wait to it will. It's don't find right now. Not important, sorry. And uh, we can change our mech. On this menu, you can find many mechs with uh, this special link. Like we are. Uh, it means that uh, this mech compatible with uh, screens on the mech, not like on UI. We can change any of them, what we like. As example, do we have K2? Ah, without K2S, as example very specific mech. Ready. Okay, next one. We should open UEVR, uh, find our process, Macquarie Win64 shipping. Uh, don't mind about this, okay? No. Next one, uh, click to open XR, not open VR, to open XR and inject. Right now, VR are on and we can use our helmet. As 
as you can see we are not centered we can click f9 and recenter all the things next step uh, to close this window click here and click here after this we only click to we should see uh, our cursor if you want to hide it uh, we only click home resume and home. depleted yeah right now we are on the map and you can see all things are work property property for your tango confirmation. Sierra 2-1, over. Airstrike support is available on this mission. I'll let you know when they reach the target area. Think what I want to told you it's about open XR toolkit. Um, sadly, I can't record uh, my helmet uh, uh, screen, um, and this menu uh, shows only on the screen uh, helmet screen. And uh, I recommend to use next uh, options like in performance, uh, you can choose upscale and sharpening as a CAS and uh, scaling uh, from 20% to 90%. I recommend uh, use 90 or something like this. After this, you should uh, restart your game and uh, enjoy to clearly view without any performance hit. And that's it. Uh, if you, I don't know, like it, <laughs> you can, um, I don't know, you, 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 if you have some questions, you can ask it uh, in the comments below, or um, if you want uh, some additional information, you can ask. Uh, I try to answer all questions. Yeah, thank you, and goodbye.